Hello everybody, welcome to another CSGO editing tutorial. In this video, it's actually not really much of a tutorial, but I will still include it in this series anyway. So in this video, I'm actually going to be giving away a reshade preset. This is actually a preset I've been working on for a couple of weeks uh, or so. And uh, this is actually supposed to be for my 9,000 subscriber um, special, I guess. But we've sort of already passed that, but oh well. Here's the preset anyway. So basically, if you haven't seen the reshade setup video yet, uh, make sure you watch that because I'm not going to be going in depth on how to set up reshade in this video because I've already made a um, separate one. So basically, all you have to do is download the reshade preset. It will just be a zip folder. All you have to do is extract it to um, wherever you want. So I've, in this case, I put it on my desktop like so. And uh, once you open up the reshade folder, what you need to do is search for reshade INI and open that in something like Notepad++ and what you get is uh, this. We need to do is change the directories for the preset search paths, the uh, screenshots paths, the effects, uh, the textures and, pre and the uh, preset files. So you just have to change the directories depending on where you have it extracted. Um, it's pretty easy to do, just copy and paste it and you can change it like that. Since I have it on my desktop and this is where I created it, I this is what I have here. So yeah, you just need to change the directories for the um, things I showed you there. And once you have that, you can just go ahead and put it into a HD like so, and launch CSGO. So I'm just gonna quickly launch CSGO and show you what the reshape preset looks like. If you haven't already seen it, I've been, uh, I've posted a couple teasers on Twitter and Facebook, as well as my Discord server. Alright, as you can see, the uh, reshape presets are going to apply. To get rid of the um, blurred uh, effect here, you just have to press F12. That is the default bind to get rid of the um, to toggle the effects and just press OK. You hit F11, that brings up the um, reshade menu. You go ahead to settings and change the binds. These are just what I have, F12 and F11 as well as F7. Hold the screenshot key and again, you can change the um, paths and stuff, which you should have already done earlier. So here are all the... Um, effects that I've applied with this uh, reshade preset and I'm quickly launch into a demo to show you what it looks like. Alright, as you can see, this is what the uh, preset looks like. It's just some basic fog, MXIO, a little bit of bump mapping and uh, depth of fields. You can go ahead and play around the settings. So if you don't want the fog, you just go ahead and disable that. Uh, there's a little bit of vibrance in here and there's also a built-in um, color grading so you can hold ahead and play with that. Uh, this is uh, the setting I have on, which is that. Uh, there's a couple um, things you can play around with this, so you can go ahead and customize it to your liking. You can make it even better if you want. Um, this is just some basic uh, stuff I put in just to make the game look a bit nicer from the um, standard um, game. So if I go ahead and play it, this is what it's going to look like. Uh, it's playing in slow motion now just so you can see a bit better. I might speed it up a bit more actually. As you can see, this is pretty much it. Um, yeah, it's pretty basic, it's nothing special. Again, you can go ahead and play with the different settings if you want uh, more depth of fields. You can play around with the uh, manual depth focus, have like, you know, super blurred, I guess. I'm not sure why you want too much of it, so just make it subtle and back like that, I guess. Uh, there is also an autofocus, but I don't use it. So yeah, that's pretty much it with this um, reshape preset. Nice and basic. Yeah, so that's pretty much it for this reshape preset. Pretty simple. Go ahead and customize it, download it. Uh, no need to credit me, just use it. I uh, hope you all enjoyed this uh, preset. Have fun using it with your edits on Frag Movies. And I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.